The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, 3rd Canto, 26th Chapter, Text Number 30, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on January 7th, 1975, in Bombay, India. Doubt, misapprehension, correct apprehension, memory, and sleep, as determined by their different functions, are said to be the distinct characteristics of intelligence. Sangsayoto vipajyaso nishchaya smithirevacha sapa ittu chati buddhi the modern psychologists that divided the function of the mind, thinking, feeling, willing, and then other subdivisions that is known as the science of psychology. But intelligence, above mind there is intelligence. I don't think in the modern science there is any analytical study of the intelligence function. But in the Vedic literature there is <coughs> analysis of the intelligence. They are described here, samsaya, uh, doubtfulness. The Sangsaya. Sangsaya Atma Vinasati. In the Bhagavad Gita, there is a statement. Those who are doubtful about the existence of God, Vinasati, they are finished. Their progress is finished. Sangsaya Atma Vinasati. That nishchayatma, that is very good. Uh, to believe, to have faith, nishchayat, uh, by full assertion. Just like Krishna says, uh, sarvadhanman purita jamame kang saranam. So if by your intelligence, you become doubtful whether Krishna is able to give me protection, then you are finished. Samsaya Atma Vinasati. But if you have faith in Krishna's words, Nishchaya, when Krishna says that if I surrender unto him, he will give me protection. There is no doubt about it. That is called faith. Nishchatmika. Bhavasatmika buddhi. Buddhi, intelligence. Bhavasatmika, nishchatmika. That is very good. Bhavasatmika buddhi ekeha kurunandana bahusakanantasya buddhi abhavasayana. Abhavasayana, those who have no faith, doubtful, they have got different branches of activities, but one who has got faith, nishchatmika, yes, here Krishna says that He will give me protection. Let me surrender. Then His life becomes successful. This is the beginning of successful life. Adho sraddha. This sraddha or this nishyatmika buddhi or bhavasatmika buddhi is the beginning of spiritual life. If one has no faith in the words of the authorities, then he has no hope. Sangsha Atma Vinasati. 
Vinasati means he does not get any chance to enter into spiritual life. Uh, we are in the material world. We are vinasatsu. Uh, we are in an uh, atmosphere of being finished. That everyone we know. This body, <coughs> I am concerned with this body, and the body is to be finished. Uh, but the soul is not finished. Therefore, our bhakti marga, how one can make progress in bhakti marga? Uh, <coughs> if you have got faith in the words of Krishna, that Krishna says, sattva dharma paritajya mami kang saranangali, if we apply our intelligence, and nishyatmika, then our spiritual life begins. Adhu sadhya tato sadhu sangha, these are the different methods to make advance in spiritual life, especially in bhakti yoga, devotional life. Tadu Sadhya, Krishna says, these are on the intellectual platform. Uh, sometimes intellectual platform is taken as sentimental, but if it is rightly taken, somebody believes, even Krishna, Krishna's statement, they are not sentimental. They are vijñāna sahitam, jñānaṁ vijñāna sahitam. Yad jñātā mokṣaṣi asubhā. Jñānaṁ vijñāna sahitam prabhokṣāmi te anasūyave. Yad jñātā mokṣaṣi asubhā. This is the statement in Bhagavad-gītā. Jnanam tiham sabi jnanam pravakshami asesat. Pravakshami asesat. Jad gyatya mokshasi asubhat. Rasubha inauspicious. We do not understand. We have taken inauspicious thing as auspicious. This is called maya. We accept something Maya illusion uh, or vivarta. We accept something for something. The example is given there is a rope, and due to my ignorance or insufficient knowledge, I take it as a snake. This is my insufficient knowledge. Uh, this snake is fact, and the rope is fact. But when we take the rope as snake, uh, that is ignorance. Or the snake as rope, that is ignorance. Uh, the Mahavadi philosopher says that we are accepting snake as uh, rope as a snake. But there is no snake. Uh, but we, Vaishnav philosopher, we say, no, there is snake and there is rope. But when we accept the rope as snake, that is Maya. Uh, similarly, there is spiritual world and there is material world. But when we accept the material world as everything, that is Maya. That is illusion. Uh, there is spiritual world. Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita that parastasmat bhava anna, there is another bhava nature. Uh, what is the nature? Uh, this sarveshu nasasu na vinasati. When the material world, this cosmic manifestation, the phenomenal world, 
will be finished, that will stay, that will not be finished. There are many examples. It's like my age in the desert. Sometimes we see this vast mass of water in the desert. The animal runs after the water, being thirsty, but there is no water. Therefore the animal dies. But human beings should not be like the animal. They should raise their standard, they have got a special consciousness. They can raise their standard of understanding uh, by these literatures, Vedic literatures given by God. Uh, Vasudeva is incarnation of Krishna. So he has given us the Vedic literature. Therefore, uh, his name is Vedabhyas, uh, incarnation of God, Vedabhyas. Mahamanikrite, Kimba Parai. There is no uh, need of speculating. Just follow Vasudev in the disciplic succession. Vasudev's disciple is Narasmani. Narasmani's disciple is Vasudev. So, in this parampara system, if we receive knowledge, then that is perfect knowledge. So, we have to accept it, nishyatmika. Therefore, Rupa Goswami says that spiritual life can be advanced. The first principle is utsah. Utsaha. Utsaha means enthusiasm. Yes, Krishna says, sarva dharma paritajya mame kaṁ I'll accept it and work enthusiastically on the principle, as Krishna says. Krishna says, manvanā bhava madhbhakta madhyāji māgna muskuru. And we have to do it, execute it enthusiastically. Yes, I shall always think of Krishna. Manvanā. Krishna says directly, Manvana, Bhavamad Bhakta, you just become my devotee. So we have to be enthusiastic. Yes, I shall become Krishna's devotee. Manmana Bhavamad Bhakta. Madhyaji. Krishna says, worship me. So you should be very much enthusiastic to worship Krishna, offer Mangalarati, rise early in the morning. These are all enthusiasm. Utsah. Those who are not enthusiastic, lazy, lethargetic, they cannot advance in spiritual life. Simply sleeping, they cannot make. One must be very, very enthusiastic, positive. Utsah, bhajya. Bhajya means patience. Yeah, not that because I have begun uh, devotional service with both great enthusiasm. So you are all already on the perfectional platform. But if you become impatient, so why I am not becoming perfect? Sometimes why Maya is kicking me? Yes, that is habitual, that will go on. It will stop. Nishyat. Vajyat nishyat. Then when Krishna says, Sarvadhanman paritajya mami kang saranang vajya, now I have given up everything. I have no other occupational duties. Simply to serve Krishna. So when I have taken to it, then nishyat, Krishna will surely Give me protection. That is called nishya. Don't be disappointed. Krishna is not 
a false speaker. He says, "Aham kwa sarva paapi bhama khusha." So we should have firm faith, nisya, uscha, nis, ah, usaha, bhijya, nischaya. But nischaya at the same time you should not sit idly. You should work according to the direction of the spiritual master. Tattat karma pravartana. Now Krishna has given me assurance. Now let me sleep. Everything will come automatically. No. Tattat karma pravartana. The spiritual master says, you must do this. You must do that. That is called tattat karma pravartana. Not that now I am initiated, and uh, that is going on in so many uh, places. Uh, the guru says, "You think of me; everything is all right." Uh, I do not wish to name, but a very big ashram. They simply sit idly, and the guru has advised to think of me. Yes. This is not Vishnu principle. Vishnu principle is you must act according to the order of spiritual knowledge. That is also an order. But the Vishnu spiritual master orders according to the shastra, sadhu shastra, guru ba. Guru mukha padma vakka chitte te koriya oikko arna koriya maneya. This is the instruction of our Acharya. Hmm. This is called Vyavasādmika buddhi. Vyavasādmika buddhi, nishchātmika buddhi means with good faith that I must execute it. That is my life and soul. If we take that, then our life is successful. Sakshādharitena samastra-śāstra Guru is accepted identical with Krishna. <coughs> Haritena. Uh, it is accepted in all the Shastras, Vedic literature. Tatha Bhavata Eva Sadhvi. And those who are devotees, pure devotees, they accept like that. Uh, so, why they accept? Kintu prabhurja priya evatas. Guru is very dear to Krishna because under the direction of Krishna, by the parampara system, his training, you do like this. This is parampara system. Do not deviate. Because he is training people according to the desire of Krishna. Krishna is desiring that everyone should surrender unto Him. That is His desire. So Guru's business is to train people how to surrender to Krishna, not to become Krishna. That is foolishness. You cannot become Krishna. Your respect is as Krishna because you are doing the most confidential service of Krishna. But if you think that you have become Krishna, then he is not Guru. Hintu Prabhu Jap Priya Evatas Sakshadharitena Samasta Sastra Ruptas Tathabhabhata Evasadhi Hintu Prabhu Jap Priya Evatas this sakshad haritena uh, equal to Krishna. Why? Priya uh, evatasya. Because he is very, very dear to Krishna. Now, how he has become dear to Krishna? Because he is preaching the same principle as Krishna wanted. Jaimang paramang guyang mad bhakti so vidhasati. Nachatta smat manusesu kaschitme priyakittama. Krishna says, 
Anyone who is preaching this confidential cult, Madhu Bhakteshu Vidhashati. Bhakteshu means amongst the devotees. Who will understand Krishna and who will surrender to Krishna unless he is bhakta? So, a guru's business is first of all to make him bhakta, then he will be able to understand what is Krishna and surrender to him. He has got very double visions. Uh, Krishna says, Mad bhakte shobhidasati. This cult who preaches, uh, anyone who preaches this cult, a bhakti yoga, amongst my devotees, he is selecting devotees. He never says, the Ganesh yogis, the Ganesh yogis will not be understand, able to understand what is Krishna. Uh, from the very beginning they think they have become Krishna. Uh, vimukta manina. They think like that. Actually it is not. Krishna is not so cheap thing that one can become Krishna. Uh, one can become Krishna's most confidence and servant. That is possible. But one cannot become Krishna. That is another illusion, māyā. Uh, therefore Krishna said that sarva dharma an mamekam saranam braja. Uh, this cult, who will understand? Unless he is devotee. Jnani yogi cannot understand. It is not possible. Ah. Because they are not bhakta, they cannot understand Krishna. Bhakta mahavijana. Krishna never says, by jnana, by yoga, by karma, one can understand me. No, that is not possible. Ah. Therefore, Gani, Jogi, Karmi, they cannot understand, therefore they are misled. Maya Mahita, Navi Janati, Mameva Paramabhyam, Trivi Gunavai Bhav. Navi Janati, they cannot understand, Mameva Paramabhyam. So Krishna says, therefore, preach this cult amongst the devotees. He never says, that this, this cult among the kormis, among the jnanis, among the yogis, because they are very unfortunate. They cannot understand Krishna. Mayavadi bhasya sunile hoye sarbhanas. One who comes in touch with the mayavadi. Mayavadi means one who thinks Krishna is also in maya. That is called mayavadi. Krishna's body is also Maya. They are called Mayavad. The Chaitanya Mahaprabhu warns that Mayavadi Bhasya Sunile Hai Sadbanas. Anyone who listens to the commentary of the Mayavadi philosopher, then his fate is doomed. He is finished. He will never be able to understand Bhakti philosophy. It is so poisonous. Uh, therefore, Sanatana Goswami has warned not to hear from Avishnu about Krishna. Uh, there is a very famous uh, Bhagavat Nida in Bombay. He is a Pakka Avishnu. But he is going on and he is. Infusing poison means those who are hearing him, they will never be able to understand what is Krishna. They will never be able. It is so poisonous. Therefore, Sanatana Goswami says, Avaishnava mukhat gina puta hari katha amritam na sabanam na kattabam. A Vaishnava, who is not Vaishnava, who is not devotee, uh, if he speaks uh, about Bhagavad Gita, Srimad Bhagavatam, nonsense, he will speak nonsense. So it is not good. Uh, 
अवैष्णवा मुखद गिरना भूत हरी कथा अमृतम सर्वनाम ना कर्तव्य यू शुड ने बैरिए ऑन प्रिंसिपल यू शुड एवॉर्ड हियरिंग फ्रॉम सन्स रेस्कल दिस इज इंजंक्शन ऑफ सनातन गुस्सा वाई ही स्पीकिंग भगवद गीता श्रीमद भागवतम वाई वन शुड नॉट हियर भगवद गीता इज वेरी नाइस दट सॉ डाइट ही गिव्स द एग्जाम्पल सर्वोच्छिष्ट पयो जथा मिल्क एवरी वन नोज मिल्क इज वेरी गुड फूड बट इफ इट इज टच बाय द लीप ऑफ ए सर्ट पैंड देन इट इज फिनिश then it is finished you die if you take such meal then your destiny is to death uh, that is very very important point that chaitanya mahaprabhu secretary uh, sarup damodar goshai he advised many the person used to come to see chaitanya mahaprabhu but he was first of all examined Ah, uh, by his secretary, whether he is uh, actually fit for talking with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Otherwise, he will simply waste his time. Uh, so one Brahmin uh, from East Bengal came with some literature. Many people used to write something. Um, so when it was examined by Sri Damodar Goswami, he said, "No." <clears throat> then he explained how the literature was defective he pointed out these are described in the chaitanya charita so then he saw the person was submissive uh, he did not protest then sarup damodar goshami advised him that you bhagavat paro giha bhagavat sthane You go to a Bhagavat, person Bhagavat, and read or hear Bhagavat from him. Otherwise, he will be misled, uh, doubtful. Uh, so, Sangshatma Binasati. Uh, so, it, it is our business uh, to be very, very careful uh, from. Uh, Understanding spiritual life or devotional life from non-devotee class of men. Uh, non-devotee means one who does not accept Krishna, the supreme personality of Godhead. He is non-devotee. Krishna bhakta ar. Uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was asked by his one de- devotee. We ask the devotee, okay, "What is the primary function of a devotee?" The Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said in two lines, "Asat sanga tagi bhishna vacha." Asat, asat means those are not devotees. They are asat. They are asat. Why asat? Because they will remain in this material world. Therefore, there are also, and those who will go to the spirit, those who will be promoted to the spiritual world, back to home, back to garden, they are sat. Om tat sat, uh, because they are being promoted to the eternal kingdom. That is sat. This is the distinction between also and sat. Those who will Perpetually, ah, uh, remain within this material world. They are called asat. The kormis, ganis, and yogis, ah, uh, yogis, they just like ah, uh, what is that? Big yogis, uh, the rishi, great rishi, ah. Uh? No, not this time. He was very angry. Durbasha, yes. Durbasha, Muni, 
लेकिन वेरी वेरी बिग जोगी हाँ सच ए बिग जोगी दैट ही कुड गो एनी वायर इवन दिस स्पिरिचुअल वर्ल्ड दिस जोगीज कैन गो ट्रेवल देर इज ए प्लैनेट विच इज कॉल सिद्ध लोक दीज आर कॉल सिद्धि जोग सिद्धि अनि वहाँ लोग ही माँ प्राप्ति नाव इट इज देर आर सो मेनी जोगीज बट दे आर नॉट सिद्ध दे कैन नॉट डिस्प्ले ऑल दीज जोग सिद्धि सिंपली बाय सम एक्सरसाइज जिम्नास्टिक दे बिकम जोगी दैट जिम्नास्टिक इज रिक्वायर्ड इन द बिगिनिंग फॉर कंट्रोलिंग द माइंड बैट दी जोग सिद्धि इज डिफरेंट दैट रिक्वायर परफेक्ट योग प्रैक्टिस अनिमा लघिमा प्राप्ति सिद्धि सीता व सीता तो देर इज ए प्लान एट विच इज कॉल सिद्ध लोक इन दैट सिद्ध लोक द इनहेबिटेंट्स आर बाई नेचर सिद्ध दे कैन फ्लाई इन द स्काई फ्रॉम वन प्लैनेट टू वन अदर प्लैनेट दे कैन गो देर इज सिद्धि Ah, there is logima siddhi to become lighter than the air, so they can fly in the air uh, without any burden. They are siddha lok. So even the siddha loka, the inhabitants who are by nature born perfect in yoga siddhi, they also could not enter into the boy kuntha lok. And Kormis, they go up to the heavenly planet, and Ganesh, they may go up to Brahma, Ifalians, uh, Parang Padam, Arujja Krishna Parang Padam, Arujja Krishna. They elevate themselves very high, so some so much so that they enter the spiritual world. Uh, परम पदम परम पदम द स्पिरिचुअल वर्ल्ड रियली परम पदम मीन्स द लोटस फीट ऑफ कृष्ण बैट परम पदम बिकॉज दिस ब्रह्म इफालजेंस इज ऑल्सो बॉडीली रेज ऑफ कृष्ण द ब्रह्म इफालजेंस इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड समटाइम्स परम पद बट दो आर एस्पायरिंग to merge into that parampada brahma they are actually not vimukta vimukta mani they are thinking now we have become liberated mani na mani na means the position is different but is thinking that i have become now perfect so why if they have gone to the spiritual world And stays in the Brahma Ifalians, and is still uh, their mani na not certain. Yes. Why? Because they cannot stay there. Ah, uh, this is very uh, logical argument and statement from the Vedic literature. Arujya ke chena paranga padanga tato apatanti adha. They fall down uh, because uh, they do not get anand. Spiritual effulgence is simply eternity. So, suppose if you live eternally without any anand, how long you will like to live like that? Is it possible that you cannot do? Uh, Suppose somebody lives eternally in the sky without any death, uh, rather he will try to commit suicide. It is not possible. Uh, it is not possible. It's like we have got experience. If you remain for very long time, I have got experience in the sea or in the air. You feel very uncomfortable. You want to land down, uh, land down another air station, another port, and feel very uncomfortable. 
the airplane when they come down and they take rest on the ground. Uh, it is not our nature because it is impersonal. In the air there is no variety, simply air. Uh, simply in the sea there is no variety, simply water. So it becomes suffocating. Similarly, those who are aspiring to go to the Brahma Ifaljans, Brahma Ifaljans is spiritual world, certainly, but there is no variety. Ah, there is no Krishna's ah, enjoying with the cowherd's voice or in Srimati Radharani. You cannot find that. You simply remain in the Brahma Ifaljans. But because we are part and parcel of Krishna, as Krishna wants enjoyment, anandamaya bhyasat, anandamaya. So we part and parcel of Krishna, we also want ananda. So to remain in the Brahma Vifalyans is not ananda, it is eternity only. It is not ananda. Uh, therefore, on, on account of absence of ānanda, they come down again to enjoy this material ānanda. We have got many experience of uh, person, uh, they, Mahābādi sannyāsī, they take sannyās, brahma sattva jagan mithā but after sometimes they come to take parts in politics. Why? Is jagat mithā why you are taking to politics? Because they could not get ananda. Nidvises, niraka, simply philosophizing, but there was no ananda. Therefore, let me go to the jail by political activities. There is ananda. <laughs> yes, they do practically. Yes. So they will take ananda in the jail. Not with Krishna. Uh, therefore, Shastra says, Arujya Krishna Parang Padang Tata Patanti Adha Anad Dita Jusmat Angraya. These class of men, although after severe penance and austerities, Arujya Krishna, very severe. Uh, penance and austerities performing, the Mahavadi, Sannyasi, those who are really following the principles, their life is very strict, uh, stricter than the Vaishnavas. Uh, so, in spite of such strict observance of rules and regulations, and rising up to the brahma because they do not get ānanda, uh, ānanda is there with Krishna, Krishna loka. ānanda cinmaya rasa pratibhāvita bhi stābhi jaiva nija rūpa taya khala bhi. Krishna is enjoying in the Goloka Vrindāvan, expanding himself in so many uh, gopīs, so many coward boys, so many trees, plants, water, land, everything, Krishna's expansion. Here also it is Krishna's expansion, this material world, bhumi rapan alabhayu, that is vinna uh, prakriti astadha, that is separated energy. Aparayam, this is inferior. Itasya vidhime prakriti para. That information is there. There is another prakriti, para prakriti. And what is that para prakriti? What is the sample? Jiva bhuta, living entities. That prakriti is living, and this prakriti is dead. That is the difference. Anyone can understand. They are also the trees, they are living trees. Here are also living trees but covered by the material body, his life is not manifested. Uh, right. Just like why he cannot go 
to other planets because I am covered by this material elements. But when I am not covered by the material elements, sarvapadi vinin muktam tat parate na nirmalam, then I can go everywhere automatically. Just like Narad Muni goes everywhere. He has no impediment. So everyone can possess that uh, status of life. Uh, so uh, this is nishcha. Uh, if we understand Krishna philosophy, Krishna consciousness rightly, then there will be no doubt uh, by intelligence. Uh, without intelligence nobody can understand Krishna philosophy. Dull-headed, poor fund of knowledge, they cannot understand Krishna. Therefore, all Krishna says, Bhunam Janmunavanti, Gyanavan. Actually, those who are thinking, they are Gyanis. They are not Gyanis. Uh, they are still in Maya, darkness. Because they think that they have finished their business. Now they have become liberated. They have become Narayan. Uh, instead of separate Narayan, each, every one of them is Narayan. They are raised among themselves Narayan. Uh, that is their foolishness. Uh, at least you must show the four hands of Narayan. Where is your four hand? You are begging and you are Narayan. What kind of Narayan is there? Not Daridra Narayan. They are manifest. Yes, I am Narayan, but Daridra Narayan. But we do not know Daridra Narayan. Narayan is Lakshmi Narayan. He is the husband of Lakshmi. So they manufacture the, all these concocted ideas. And therefore it is called Manino. They are thinking that become liberated. Vimukta Mani. They are ordinary living beings, but they can be fooled, some foolish persons, but they are not liberated. They are under the spell of Maya. Uh, even Sankarajaj Vyaksa, Narayana para of Bhaktiya. Narayana is not a living being of this world, but his followers, they are thinking, I am Narayana. They do not know even their original pleasure. It is clearly written by Sankaracharya. Narayana para abhaktyat. So, and in the Shastra it is said, Jastu Narayana devam Brahma Rudraji daivatai ekatena ar samatena vikheta sa pasandi bhavadivam. Pasandi, unbeliever. Uh, atheist, uh, infidel, faithless, they are called passion. So anyone who thinks Narayan on the same level with such exalted demigods like Lord Shiva and Lord Brahma, Brahma Rudradi Daivati, Samatena Vikheta, if he puts Narayan on the same level, Sa Pasandi Bhavadhuvam, he is passion. So this Pasandi is a flower is saying in this story Jo uh, on account of our these doubts. Uh, hmm? What is that? Sangsaya. This Sangsaya. So the first business of spiritual life is to become free from Sangsaya. Because Sangsaya Atma Vinasati. We should accept the statement of the Shastra. We should accept the statement of authorities and make our life following evang uh, parampara uh, praptam. That is actually parampara system, as Krishna says, as Krishna's devotee says, his authorized agent says, then our life will be successful. Otherwise, samsayatma vinasya. Thank you very much.